Just on the other side of this mountain is a beautiful desert vacation home where rats are taking over and we're about to figure out how they're getting in right now. All right, so here we are right behind this beautiful gate is our customer Colby who's just at his wit's end, wants this problem solved. The last time I saw him, he looked right in my eyes and said, David, I don't even want to come here anymore. I'm so frustrated. The smell that's coming into his master bedroom is just absolutely terrible. He's had multiple pest control companies. He's replaced his roof and he's just tired of it. So I'm excited today to bring our team and solve this once and for all for Kobe. Oof, right here is where you can hit that, that smell coming right here. Other pest control companies have opened here. They've put an access panel. But I've asked uh, Colby to move all his clothes out of here so we have access to do what we need to do. So Colby's heard it in this bathroom as well. He just remodeled. So I'd hate to tear out this tile. So hopefully we don't have to, to do any demolition here. And then here, all this floor here, back to his master's, all on a slab foundation. So we have no access underneath this house at all. They got it sealed off like Fort Knox. Getting our HEPA air scrubber here. And we just discharge it to the outside. A lot of our focus is going to be right in this area right here. So here's some rodent droppings by his air conditioning system here. Give you an idea what this roof looks like. Brand new roof. He thought it was going to solve his uh, rat issue. What's interesting is Kobe was telling me that the local pest control companies here in the desert were telling him that, oh, you don't have really much of a problem. Just set some traps up. And he kept telling him, no, this is a serious problem. It's getting worse, although it does come and go, but the odor is so bad that it's just, it's just getting worse. And again, this is a vacation home. Rodents are very, very smart. They're keen as to who's coming and going. And vacation homes are one of the worst because the damage always takes place when homeowners are gone for a long period of time. So that's something to consider when you have a vacation home, especially here in the desert. You need to put in the proper prevention, which is exclusion and then that sewer pipe if you do have a lot of rodent issues and you can't solve it they're definitely going to be in that sewer pipe folks all right this roof you guys is so tough to walk on walk on this edge here so you don't break any so this is where the master bathroom is the data was inconclusive i want to get smoke in here it's a very, very complicated structure here. It's a beautiful home, but we have no access. We don't have access underneath. This tile is complicated. We have no attic space and it's hot out here. Yep, I can smell it now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely in this area right here is where we're picking up that smell. We activated by using a special tool because sewer gases, they come and go. So just because you don't get a smell doesn't mean that it's not there. You've got to be able to activate it if it's not there at the time that you're sniffing these vents out. I'm excited to see what the cause is here, but it does look like it's going to be sewer rats. Oh man, look at that. The mains right here, right? Uh -huh. I wonder if this is gonna pick up the master bathroom too, because it all goes right here. Where's the master at? Master's way on the other side of the house. So I don't know if this is gonna pick up the entire sewer line. Ooh, another rat, huh? No. Oh, Fog there's it, a right? clean out right there. What? <laughs> well, no, it's buried though. I don't think we're gonna be able to have access to it. So let's cut it right here. We'll give him a proper clean out to the crawl space as well so he has access to this old cast iron pipe. A little bit of a burrow right here between the slab, look at this. That's where the air conditioning lines go. This could be it. Damn, I forgot my thong bathing suit again, guys. I'd be sitting right there, swimming just enjoying the view here. So this is the access here. I don't really have much access because of this. So we're gonna, gotta get this thing opened up so we can really get our heads in there, get plenty of visibility up here. I don't see any pipes. Okay, let's hit the smoke. A few moments later. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, we're getting it. We're getting it. We're getting it. I just don't know where it's coming from. Oh my guys, look at this guys. Uh, we ran a camera down. Look at the rat. Look at the rat. Look at the rat. Look at the rat. Look at the rat right there. Look at him moving around. I've never seen this, you guys, on camera. On a sewer camera. Whoa. Look at him. Look at him. Let's see what he does. Shut the water off. Oh. All right, so we definitely know that these are sewer rats. Unbelievable. Kobe? Yeah. Look at this. We're running the camera down the sewer pipe yeah. in front of your master there. Yeah. And look at this, uh, a rat right oh, there in the sewer. Oh, a little rat. Well, we know they're in the pipes. Well, yeah, exactly. At least, at least that. They're, they're in the we sewer pipe. Yeah. Okay, so we ran the, <clears throat> ran the camera from above. Check it out. Go ahead, Victor. All right, you can see how all of this insulation is completely ruined with rat urine and rat droppings. Man, oh man, that's gross. We found a separation? Yes, we did. We did? Okay, where's the... Oh, yeah. Yep. Doesn't look like a chew. Okay, well, let's go ahead and open up that bedroom wall. See what we get. Okay, so I'm going to show you why Colby's getting an awful smell. I like my sixth wife. No. More, yeah, it's more like my third wife. <laughs> uh, you can see the wires too. That pipe is right here. So instead of dealing with this, we're gonna go ahead and open up the bedroom wall. Good job, guys. Eventually. Okay, so we cut this pipe right here, and look what we got, a big ball of roots. There they are, right there. Those are all roots. And a lot of rat droppings right here. So this is definitely the runway. It was going up, and then they were getting in the soffit over there where the closet is. Okay, so Colby uh, went ahead and approved us demoing this floor right here. We're gonna tunnel underneath. We're gonna repair that pipe that has the roots, fill up that, that burrow. We're gonna put in a couple backflow devices outside. It's a big job. We're gonna deodorize the entire home. We've got a lot of work here, guys, but we're getting it. This was a great, great find. I'm so, so happy that we were able to detect this one burrow here. We are gonna fix this and continue to make sure that there's nothing else happening within his house here so got a lot of work to do but great find day two day two this is gonna be a big day check out what we've got going on here we've got the Mac daddy jackhammer we'll be tearing this up today digging down it's gonna be interesting what we find under here so we started digging we got down about 10 inches we found another concrete floor Another one. Now we're having to break all this concrete here. Victor, you see the burrow yet? No. No? Not yet. All right. Let's get a bottle of water, dump it down that burrow. And then I'm going to go over there and see if we see any water coming out of that hole. See any water? Oh, yeah, yeah. We got you see water? water? Yeah. All the way up in there. Is that the burrow? Yes, it is. Okay. He's a genius. Day three. All right, this is day three. And today is going to be 114 degrees. <laughs> so on this side of the house, where we're going to be installing is a backflow device. Because this is a vacation home, we don't want these pipes sitting idle because what will happen is these rats sense the fact that no one's home. So it's much easier for them to get aggressive, get through here and chew their way back into this house. So what we're gonna do is uh, install a clean out for Colby because on this side of the house, he has no access to run a cable if his main sewer line, which is made of cast iron, backs up. So we've installed the proper clean out as well as this right here. So here's the clean out right here. Okay, so what we did was we took some of our fused mesh, stainless steel screws, secured it to this uh, plastic flap here, and then we took our uh, Flex Seal and made a waterproof barrier so this doesn't rust out with the moisture. 
But look at that, the rats cannot chew through this little flap right here. This is how it goes in, just drops down here like this. So as the rats come through from the city sewer, they're not able to chew their way in. But as the fixtures are being used, this will open up allowing the toilet paper to go through. All right, let's get this thing installed. Raul, oh, I don't know what you're doing standing around. Watching the movie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Raul, finally got to cutting this out. Oh, look at this. This thing was all cast iron, which is the hardest pipe to cut, especially when you have all of the gas lines, water lines, sprinkler lines, electrical. High power gas line. Oh yeah, we got uh, city gas here. Yeah, right there. Let's give a round of applause to Raul for doing such an amazing job, Raul. exhausting this heat can get it just drains you to the degree where you just want to you want to give up but we got to keep this job going <laughs> excuse me 10 minutes later he's still sleeping All right, so now all the plumbing's in, we're starting to backfill and clean up. What we're gonna do is to deodorize this place, really get all of that last little bit of odor out. We're gonna go ahead and set up our five gallon bucket here, half full of water. We're gonna drop our deodorizer pucks in here. And what that's gonna do is gonna off gas get into all of the duct system, get here into the soffit area and kill all that smell. All right, you can see how that's uh, agitating the water there. Now what we're gonna do is drop the puck in. All right guys, this was an amazing find. I'm so glad we were able to detect this for Cody. This was a lot of work in this heat, but we solved it, right guys? Yes, yes we did. Hey, what, what about, about the, the rat dad? dad? Oh, the rat dads. This is for sure deserving of the rat dads. Yeah.